Action for your collectors, pop culture lovers, and comic fans out there, you're watching Ghazali's reviews. This is Ghazali, and today I'll be reviewing a Street Fighter 4 player select Chun Li figure by NECA. So, as you guys can see, that uh, this is a booster packaging. The figure can be seen clearly inside, along with all the relevant accessories. On top, here is the Street Fighter 4 logo. Here is the picture of Chun Li herself. Here it is written chunli with bold letters and it says that there are 35, 31 points of articulation with 5 hands. This package includes and here is the age restriction mark. On this side we can see the images of chunli in some dynamic poses. On the other side we can see the player select logo, Capcom logo, logo warning stuff and here is the Street Fighter 20th anniversary logo. And on the back side we can see the image that tells us about the points of articulation in this figure and here is the brief bio of Chun Li and here are the other figures from this series which includes Akuma, Chun Li herself and Guile and finally at the bottom here we can see the names of uh, people who have contributed in the manufacturing of this figure and again some logo and you know reference and stuff etc so that's it for the packaging let's pop this figure out and take a look look what actually it's made of stay tuned here it is a chunli out of the packaging and this figure came with uh, some extra interchangeable hands which includes these uh, open palm hands and uh, right fisted hand so that's it for the accessories so moving finally towards the figure and uh, about the figure there are some complaints with this figure in my opinion uh, firstly the legs are too much bulky I think uh, they should be a bit thinner and uh, secondly there are too much uh, paint chippings all around the figure and thirdly uh, the figure is not accurate in scale with the other figures what I mean is that uh, it's a female figure and it should be shorter than the male figures from this series for example this Rio figure and you guys can clearly see that uh, this Chunli figure is a bit taller than Rio which she shouldn't be so putting it aside and moving towards the figure this is the front view this is the side view and this is the rear view of Chun Li action figure. So let's talk about articulation. Her head moves left and right. She can look upward that much, downward that much. The arms move back and forth, outward that much. There is a swivel in the biceps here, double joint in the elbows. There is a swivel in the wrist as well as up and down hinge motion and then uh, there is an app crunch here as well as swivel in the waist the legs can kick forward that much backward that much outward that much and there is also a swivel in the upper thigh section double joint in the knees as well as a swivel in the shin here and uh, up and down hinge motion in the feet and finally this toe articulation so that's it followed for the total articulation in this Chun Li action figure so now for some height comparisons here it is Chun Li side by side with Batman from Arkham Origins video game Marvel select Black Widow and Rio and Akuma from the from the same Street Fighter 4 video game all of these figures are of a 7 inch scale this Batman has been manufactured by DC Direct or DC Collectibles Black Widow has been manufactured by Diamond Select Toys while these three figures the Street Fighter figures has been manufactured by NECA that's my review folks hope you have enjoyed it don't forget to like share subscribe and comment and if you have already been subscribed just hit the bell icon so you never miss any videos from Ozali's reviews you can also follow Ozali's reviews on Facebook as well links in the description below so until next time this is Ozali over and out